Okay, in this example, we want to go ahead and differentiate y equals sine x all to the power 4. Now, the first thing you always want to do for when you've got trig problems is to rewrite it as y equals open bracket sine x all to the power 4, because this makes it look way easier. And the trick is, is that because you've got something wrapped in a bracket and it's got a high power, you want to always let the inside bit by bu. So what we can say, we can say, okay, let u equal now sine x. And therefore, we, the y becomes y equals u to the power 4. Because remember, you just called all of that u. And now let's go ahead and differentiate both of them. We've got du over dx. That's always going to be cos x. Sine becomes cos. And then for the, for the y expression, you've got dy over du. If you differentiate that, you should get 4u to the power 3. And now, as always, for the chain rule, you can always multiply these two last bits. That's it. That's how it works. Always times these two together. So we say, therefore, the final result, dy over dx, is going to equal cos x times 4u to the power 3. Now, we know what u is. So you have to put everything in terms of x. u is sine x. So we can say, therefore, it's going to be, let's put a 4 in front, 4 cos x sine to the power 3x. And that's it, guys. That's literally the chain rule done.